بسم الله الرحمن الرحیم ربی زیب نیلم ربی شرح لی صدری و ایسر لی امری و حسل اگر سمی لسانی کو قولی بسم الله الرحمن الرحیم Before we start the paper, we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to help us. We are doing 0452-22, February, March 2023. I have already solved the first question. I will send, write the link in the comments below. Now we will be doing question number two of this paper today. So as you guys can see, I have shared the question on the screen now. On the left hand side, we have the question and on the right hand side, we will be doing the solution. So question number two says that Rai is a trader he has prepared his trial balance at 31st January 2023. The credit side totaled 152 more than the debit side. Rai placed the difference in the suspend account, which means that when he was trying to total the balances, the credit side was heavier by 152 and the debit side was actually lower by 152. So this was because of some errors. Now it says Rai later discovered the following errors. So the question says prepare the journal entries to correct the errors from 1 to 5. Narratives are not required. So we will be correcting these errors. So the first question is wages 200 had been entered in the cash book but omitted from the wages account. Now look guys many people get confused about how to solve errors. The easiest way, the tip that I can or the advice I can give you guys is that think about the correct entry first. This is how we will be solving as well today in our class. All right. So the correct entry, the correct entry would be wages debited. All right. Basically wages 200 had been entered in the cash book. So wages would be debited over here because it's an expense let me use this pen number one you would debit the wages all right by 200 and you would credit you let's say you paid by cash now look you recorded cash you recorded cash but you failed to record wages so now what will you guys do let me open the file you guys will write over here one this is the first error we forgot to record wages so we will debit wages again there is nothing to credit because we had already credited cash all right in the cash book so we will credit suspense now by how much <clears throat> 200 so this was actually your first entry now let's move on to our second one it says a credit purchase 247 from stella had been debited to stella's account and credited to the purchase account now look don't get confused just write the correct entry so if i asked you what would be the correct entry if we had not made the mistake we would have said that we would have per uh, debited purchases and we would have credited stella all right by how much 247 247 but we actually did the opposite all right we had debited stella and we had credited purchases by 247 so in order to correct this error now we will reverse it so again you would debit purchases you would credit stella but you will not do it by 247 because if you do it by 247 first you will cancel the error all right first you will cancel the error and then you have to re-record it you have to record the purchases again so we will do it by twice the amount we will do it by 247 multiply by 2 which is 494 so 494 over here 494 over here all right so second error purchases debit and stella credit by how much 494 and again 494 first we removed the error and then we had written the correct entry all right third entry it says the rent pay rent payable account and the sales account had both been overcast by hundred dollars okay 
so basically what mistake they have made is actually that you had sales and rent account so in the rent is debited by nature and sales is credited so they had overstated yani they had written it by 100 more all right so they had made this mistake we have to decrease sales now so in order to decrease sales we will debit sales by 100 and we have to decrease our rent as well because we had overstated our rent so rent will also be credited by 100 so we will go back here we will say sales debit rent credit by how much 100 100 next question it says a check for motor expenses 75 had been debited twice to the motor expense account so basically what you had done sorry this is the wrong page i just opened what we had done basically you had written motor expenses account all right and bank account bank account so over here you wrote the correct entry 75 but in your motor expenses you wrote 150 because you had recorded it by twice now we have to decrease our motor expenses all right so we would actually credit motor expenses so in the fourth entry i would credit motor expenses by 75 and since we had written the correct amount in the bank we won't write bank so what will we write now we will actually write suspense which is 75 again okay fifth entry it says a payment to Jasper 196 had been recorded as 169 so look guys payment to Jasper basically means that you have to write Jasper you are paying him by cash or bank doesn't matter okay so you had to pay him 196 all right but by mistake you had written one how much you had written 169 so did you wrote less or more we wrote less we actually had to pay we had to pay him more all right we may even have paid him more but we recorded less so we will now debit jasper again by how much 196 minus 169 so that's 27 so we have to debit jasper right now debit jasper by how much 27 and since we had written the correct amount in our bank or cash it doesn't matter we will just write suspense now which is 27 so now we are done with the first four errors moving on to the next part it says oh so uh, this is suspense account okay now we have to make the suspense account so what i have done for you guys right now here is that on the left hand side we have the journal entries where we corrected the errors and on right hand side we have to continue with the suspense account so if we read the question the question said that the credit side totaled 152 more than the debit side all right so we will start here we will write the date it's 2023 let me zoom it in for you guys let me just zoom it in for you guys so that you guys can see it better the whole thing is coming yeah 2023 all right jan 31st first you guys will write difference on uh, difference on trial balance let me write tb you guys write the whole thing i'm just writing trial b all right so it's 152 perfect now again 2023 jan 31st okay so if you look over here wages were debited and suspense was credited so suspense is being credited because of wages since this is suspense account suspense is being credited we will write wages because suspense is being credited because of the wages what is the amount 200 second we have suspense again and it is suspense debit motor expenses credit okay so suspense is debit because of motor expenses motor expenses you write the whole thing i'm just writing exp 75 and then in the last error you have 
Jasper debit and suspense credit. So suspense is being credited because of Jasper. So you will write 27. Now you guys will total both sides and when you will total the debit and the credit side now both will be equal. It will be 227 and this side will also be 227. So that's how you have to solve the suspense account. Now let's move on to the next question. It says calculate rise profit after correction of error 1 to 5. So look guys his profit was 9800 okay draft profit just write draft profit 9800 so look first of all we will deduct wages all right the first error error one error one wages we will deduct the wages which were not recorded then you guys have purchases we had not recorded these purchases, so purchases, we will record purchases, error 2, sorry, error 2, purchases. We will reduct 494. Okay, then in the next part, it basically says that sales debited, rent credited, we won't be recording, it's not affecting our profit. Then error 4, let me write over here, error 4. We had by mistake overstated our motor expenses. We had recorded more motor expenses than the actual. So now we will deduct it. All right. For example, your expense of 1000, but you recorded it as 2000. All right. So this is a mistake. So you will add 1000 back. Same. We will add 75 back as profit error for motor expenses. So now and last one, Jasper debit suspense credit won't be affecting our profit. So we will subtract 2494. We will add 75. So our corrected profit would be, our corrected profit would be 9181. Okay. Next question it says Rice trial balance was used to check the arithmetic accuracy of the ledger accounts. This journal was used to correct errors state one other use of trial balance so you guys can say it is used to help us with the financial statements with what with the financial statements okay second question is one other use of the journal so there are many uses of the journal you can say writing writing of irrecoverable debts okay ir recoverable i'm forgetting spellings recoverable debts all right so easily this way you guys can get 20 out of 20 marks all right so now i hope you guys were able to understand all the questions which i just taught if you find this video to be helpful it would absolutely mean a lot if you guys can like like subscribe and share my channel please please do so please do share it with your friends and if you guys still do not understand anything let me know uh, besides that um, i will be putting down the links of the other videos for example question one question two question three i will be putting that down as well so please do like subscribe and share it would really mean a lot and do mention show your support in the comments below bye bye guys take care sorry for half of my hand being shown bye bye